Good morning, everyone. I'm on a walk outside in 85 degree weather in Southwest Florida. I have to say, I haven't really walked outside much because it's just so hot down here. But I got up early this morning and decided to take my walk. And I gotta tell you, the flowers, they're just so beautiful everywhere. I mean, every place, look how, I don't know if you can see, but everything is so pretty. And um, I'm just really enjoying it. I mean, the sky, my goodness, the sky, it's as blue as can be and not a cloud in the in view, just gorgeous. The birds are singing. <laughs> So if you do go out in this heat, make sure you have a bottle of iced water. And you know what I do? I stick a, paper, a wet paper towel in the freezer. And then just before I go outside, I stick it under my cap to keep my head cool. And the reason I do that, look how pretty everything is, is because my son told me many years ago that your head has a lot to do with the temperature in your body. So, you know, never go out in the cold without a cap. And if you want to stay, you know, in the, if you want to stay warm and if you want to stay cool, you have to put something cold on your head, which I would have never thought. But my son is really smart. So I pay attention to what he says. Anyway, um, I just wanted to say, I want you all to think about something that you're so grateful for today. What are you so grateful for? I'll tell you what I'm grateful for. I'm grateful for the freedom that I have. I'm grateful that God has provided and I can take care of myself. I'm grateful for my amazing friends. Now, let me tell you, I have a lot of friends, tons of friends, but I have a very small handful of really, really good friends. And those are the friends I cherish. I mean, I love you all, but my good friends. And, um, oh dear, oh, sorry, my hand got tired. <laughs> um, and so I'm grateful for my friends. Of course, I'm grateful for my family. I really admire my daughter for her strength and her courage and her ability to really make an amazing life for herself. And I am very proud of my son. He has stayed with his passion his whole life, which is music. And he has really, really become an amazing musician. And I'm really proud of him. Both of my kids are happy. That's a real plus. Good morning. That's another thing. Whenever you pass anybody here, they always say good morning and wave and smile. And for a lot of people in this community who live alone, that is priceless because that may be the only person they see in a day. So it's really important to say hello to people when you pass by. I think so anyway, and I always do say hello. Um, so uh, see what you appreciate today. Look at your life and think of maybe three things that you really, really appreciate. and. To make it more interesting, we'll leave out family and friends, all right? So for me, if I had three things I wanted to be grateful for, it would be that, um, that I can take care of myself 100% without anyone's help. That's a good thing. Um, the second is my health, because I have great health, and I always have, and I'm super grateful for that. And the third thing is that in all things, I do trust Jesus. And for me, that's very important. Now I understand some people may be of different faiths and that's fine. Uh, you, you put your trust in whatever you care about, I don't know, but for me, it's Jesus. <laughs>